King Charles and his not-so-little sister, Princess Anne, are only a few months apart in age. Princess Anne was born on the 15th of August 1950, when King Charles was only 21 months old. He wasn't even up to two years old at the time of her birth. Their two other siblings, Prince Andrew and Prince Edward, were born much later. When Princess Anne and King Charles were very young, their mother, the famous Queen Elizabeth II, was crowned as Queen on the 2nd of June, 1953. For a while, it was just the King and the Princess Royal, while their mother attended to royal duties. Although it's no news that the two senior royals had their share of fights as siblings while growing up, their love for each other isn't hidden. Keep watching as we unravel the bonds shared between the British monarch King Charles and his only sister, Princess Anne. Before we delve deep into the bond shared between King Charles and his sister, Princess Anne, let's quickly take a look at what their growing up looked like. Their early years. King Charles and Princess Anne had only themselves for a while, and even though they fought like cats and dogs while growing up, they relied on themselves when their parents were out on royal tours. From pictures of the two, it is clear that King Charles adored his sister and was often by her side, pecking her or holding her hands. From when they were little, King Charles has always looked out for his younger sister. This was portrayed by a heartwarming moment of King Charles and the Princess Royal captured on camera in Malta in 1954. After their parents' long tour of the Commonwealth, King Charles assisted his sister in stepping down as they reunited with their parents. Growing up together also made them share some common interests. Their sibling bond grew over gardening together. King Charles's love for nature can be traced back to his growing up days with his sister, Princess Anne. In an interview with BBC Radio 4, King Charles reminisced on beautiful memories of how he learned gardening with his sister, Princess Anne, while growing up. He revealed that with the help of head gardener, Mr. Fred Nutbeam, he and his sister, Princess Anne, had a little vegetable patch at the back of a border in Buckingham Palace, where they had great fun growing tomatoes and other things that didn't grow. Their love for gardening as little children has grown into a strong passion for both the King and the Princess Royal to this day. Apart from gardening, they also share a similar love for horses. Their love for horses. One shared interest between the two senior royals is their love for horses. King Charles was a keen polo player ever since he was a teenager and had to retire from his polo career in 2015 as a result of several injuries. His sister, Princess Anne, was a horse lover who started horse riding at the age of 11. She won a gold medal for her riding at the 1971 European Championship and was even voted as the BBC's Sports Personality of the Year. She loved riding horses so much that she engraved her name in the equestrian world. Her passion for horses riding made her compete as a member of the British equestrian team in 1976 Montreal Olympics. She was the first royal ever to compete in the Olympics. King Charles and Princess Anne's love for horses was certainly gotten from their late mother, Queen Elizabeth II, who had a true passion for horses and rode well into her 90s. If you want to be part of our family, quickly subscribe to our channel so we can keep spilling the royal tea. Aside from their love for horses and gardening, they both also faced similar challenging times. Their failed marriages. Both King Charles and Princess Anne had problems with their first marriages around the same time. Anne separated from her first husband, Captain Mark Phillips, and they eventually divorced in 1992, the same year that King Charles and Diana's marriage hit the rock. It was certainly a difficult moment for both King Charles and Princess Anne. Their pains and trying times made them even more connected. 
having to go through similar experiences of divorce, which is a no-no for royals, help to strengthen their bond. Over the years, their bond continues to grow stronger as their sense of humour for one another. King Charles and Princess Anne's sense of humour King Charles and the Princess Royal are always present for key moments in their lives and for each event that they attend, royal fans cannot help but giggle at their sense of humour and affection towards each other. With Princess Anne, King Charles is never bothered about the tensions or burdens of royalty. Rather, he's always a goofy big brother around his younger sister, and they are always seen sharing heartwarming moments filled with laughter amidst public glare and cameras. One such moment was recorded on camera at an event in one of the royal palaces in 2018. King Charles, then the Prince of Wales, was seen tiptoeing behind his sister and surprising her in the clip. Princess Anne, on the other hand, turned around laughing and they were both seen talking affectionately while Princess Anne continued to giggle. Their gestures got many reactions on social media, with many commending them for being so close as ever, even with King Charles at 72 and Princess Anne at 70 years old at the time. Amidst the humour among both siblings, they have also shown support to each other in their times of grief. Princess Anne walks side by side with King Charles during their father's funeral. As the only daughter of the late Prince Philip, the Princess Royal walked side by side with her father's coffin with her older brother King Charles in a sober moment with each of them being a source of comfort to one another at their time of grief. Even though women aren't often included in a royal funeral procession, Anne made it clear that she wanted to go with her brother and the other males in her family to say her final goodbyes to her father. And when they had just started to recover from the grief and loss of their father, Prince Philip, the duo still had to be present for their mother's final hours. Queen Elizabeth II's final hours with Charles and Anne by her side. King Charles and Princess Anne shared the Queen's final moments on earth with her. Both of them were at their mother's side when she passed away on the 8th of September 2022 in Balmoral Castle. This certainly was another sober moment for them. Imagine watching as ever energetic mother go frail with life leaving her body. King Charles and Princess Anne were in Scotland to attend the Braemar Highland Gathering with the Queen, who was their patron of the event. But that didn't happen, as they had to be by their mother's deathbed. After the Queen's death, Princess Anne stated that she was lucky to share in the last moments of her mother's life. Even in times of grief, the Princess Royal was still concerned about her older brother, King Charles. Princess Anne's statement of loyalty to her brother after her mother's death. Although Princess Anne was mourning the death of her mother, she also remembered her brother and pledged her allegiance to him as the new monarch. In her statement, the Princess Royal expressed her gratitude for the kindness and understanding shown to her dear brother Charles as he took on the additional duties of being the monarch. Her loyalty to her brother, King Charles, and the throne is unquestionable as she played a major role in his coronation as king. Anne's role in King Charles's coronation. During her brother's coronation, Princess Anne had the prestigious role of gold stick in waiting. The Princess Royal rode a horse and performed the distinguished ceremonial function of gold stick in waiting as the newly crowned king and queen departed Westminster Abbey in the gold state carriage. She led 6,000 soldiers from the Abbey all the way to Buckingham Palace through the Mall. The parade was the largest since Queen Elizabeth II's coronation in 1953. Despite being a ceremonial role, the job was a very intimate one. The monarch's security is the responsibility of the gold stick in waiting. It is not surprising that Charles has selected his younger sister Anne to be his protector. 
She is the one person he has known all his life and her love for him and loyalty to the throne is true. She's certain to be by her brother's side throughout his reign as king. Princess Anne will be involved in King Charles's monarchy. Princess Anne is referred to as the hardest working royal of the British royal family because her schedule is always full and she takes a larger number of jobs and engagements than others. Her older brother, King Charles, is aware of his sister's commitment to the crown and her devotion to the work of the monarch. He knows that he has a faithful and loyal ally in his sister and would certainly include her in his new monarchy. Talking about being a king with additional responsibilities, the new king didn't forget his only sister's birthday. King Charles shares touching behind the scenes coronation photo in honor of Princess Anne's birthday. For Princess Anne's 73rd birthday, on the 15th of August, 2023, King Charles paid her a birthday tribute with two heartwarming photos which got royal fans beaming with smiles. With the description, wishing Her Royal Highness, the Princess Royal, a very happy birthday today. Buckingham Palace posted two pictures of the siblings to the royal family official Instagram and Facebook accounts. The first picture is a never before seen photograph of Charles and Anne shot at Westminster Abbey on the 6th of May 2023 during the King's coronation. It shows them grinning and gazing affectionately at one another. It was lovely to see that despite his busy schedule on the day of his coronation, the King still had time to goof around with his sister, Princess Anne. Even with the different challenges and duties that come with being a royal, King Charles III and Princess Anne have shown to the world that they first had a brother-sister relationship before all the royal titles and responsibilities. Their constant show of love and affection for each other, regardless of the glare of the public spotlight, is something that continues to warm our hearts. There is no doubt that the Princess Royal will be a shoulder to lean on for her brother King Charles throughout his reign as King of the British people. What do you think about King Charles and the bond he shares with his sister, Princess Anne? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section below. Click here to watch more videos and thanks for watching. See you in the next video.